Hey everyone and welcome back to another Bisect Hosting server tutorial. In today's tutorial, we're going to go over how to reset a world on a Minecraft server. We will first go over how to reset the world, and then we will go over how to change and create a brand new world for your Minecraft server. Before we get started, make sure to back up files locally so you save all necessary files. First, we're going to log into our Bisect Hosting Games panel, and we're going to choose our Minecraft server. Next, we're going to choose the stop button to stop the server. We will then choose the config files drop down menu and choose server properties. We will then scroll to where it says save file name and we're going to take note of that name. For mine, it is my world. Once we know the world name, we will then go to the files tab. Within these folders, we are going to look for our world name. So mine was my world and here it is. We are going to click the box next to the My World folder. If you also want to reset My World Nether and My World The End, you can also check those folders as well. Once we've checked those, we can then delete them. It will ask to verify and we will choose Delete. Once that's deleted, we can go back to the Home tab, start our server, and we'll reset the world on our Minecraft server. We will now go over how to create a brand new world on our Minecraft server. First, we're going to log into our Bisect Hosting Games panel and choose our Minecraft server. Next, we're going to choose the Stop button to stop the server. We will then go to the Config Files drop-down menu and choose Server Properties. Within here, we're going to look for where it says Save File Name. We are going to change this save file name to something different than it currently is. Once we've done so, we can go back to the Home tab, start our server, and we'll have created a new world on our Minecraft server. If you have any questions, check out our knowledge base, bisecthosting.com kb, or you can submit a support ticket on our website. If this guide was helpful, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe for more content like this, comment down below which guide you would like to see next, and we'll see you around.